The experience that I've had with the language program here has been great. And I love the professors and I love the emphasis on it. Not to mention the support that research gets here for it's also language research kind of thing. I just, I wish there were more opportunities to interact with people who know German. I know that there are so many German speakers on campus who don't take German classes, who don't really know how to interact. I'm, but that's the only thing that I would have improved about the language program is having a place for us to be and to mingle and to learn from each other and having it be like that, I think. Hello, welcome. I am Joe Ward, the Dean of the College of Humanities and Social Sciences, and I am just so excited to welcome you here on this beautiful early spring day in Cache Valley. We are extremely excited to begin the process of building a new home for our Department of World Languages and Culture. I'd just like to thank you all for the opportunity to come and be able to give this blessing. This the place here is where our people used to come and live. And we also bring our people here to get well in this valley, to not get well physically, but also in our spiritual way. And now we have many people here. We're all one people today. The languages that we will hear, listen and learn from each other will help us better understand, help us better to live, help us better to know the things that will keep our children in line and in peace with one another. This building is a building of opportunity for our students to learn other languages, become acquainted with other cultures, and frankly speaking, I think this building, Global Teaching and Learning Center, and the Peace Institute would take this university to the highest level of international recognition and respect. Thanks to the hard work of our president, the dean, and the brilliant faculty members that we have at the College of Humanities and Social Sciences, and the wonderful staff that we have. It's an exciting moment. Uh, this is my 20th year at the university. I never imagined that we would be at a point where this, you know, we would have our own building. Um, it's also nice to see that this has come to fruition after a number of years of trying to fight for it. It's an exciting time. It's honestly really it's exciting. Cool. Yeah, because we're only first years, right? Yeah. But we're we're really invested yeah. in the Japanese program. Well, and it's no secret our rooms are a little bit old. <laughs> yeah. Oh yeah. Totemo, totemo, totemo uresi this. Hi. <laughs> I'm super excited. Yeah. Yes. So it's, it's, Hi. it's incredibly exciting. Silly as it might sound for this to be about a building, but it represents a lot of really good opportunities for especially language students to get to interact with the language and cultures a lot more, which I think is very critical when you're learning about different places around the world. I think this this initiative is a great one because uh, Arabic is not spoken in the area, so it's hard for students to practice that language outside of the classroom. So having the center and organizing, having the room where there will be cultural events, it will be a great opportunity for students to learn and to have that immersive environment. <laughs>